So, what I need to do is make this machine easy to control. So the Y axis and the X axis and the Z axis are all easy to control initially before I start getting this running on G-code. So what I've decided to do is with the O drive connect it up to the Arduino so the Arduino controls the O drive also controls end stops eventually controls the backlash of the axis and also so that I've got some sort of hand control to easily operate the machine and then eventually add the G-code which is computer control for this to machine out certain parts and then to control it I've got this Helicopter, I'm not going to use a helicopter, just an indoor helicopter that doesn't work, the battery's gone on it. So I'm going to put that to one side and I'm going to take this controller apart and I'm going to use the potentiometers on here, see how good they are. And on here, the on and off switch, this three position switch, an on and off switch here, and another variable resistor there to control the mini machine. See how accurate that is. I'll probably upgrade that later on. This is just for testing. Also what you need is a cup of tea and a baby monitor. Although I'm gonna put that to one side. And a multi-core cable to take from here. I'm not gonna run this via infrared. Although you could, I won't wanna break communication with the Arduino while I'm milling something out. Right, time to strip this down. Right, so it's got two potentiometers, one there and one there. Then it's got another one there for that control. Take them bits off. Then a switch here, a three-way, a one, two-way switch here, a three-way switch here, a potentiometer here as well. So we can use one, two, three, four analog inputs. One, two, three, four digital inputs. So four analog inputs and four digital inputs on the Arduino. So from that black wire, the charge cable, that I'd say is negative. Here's that resistor. Most of the other components has a jump up to there, to that point there, black there, jumper to there, get rid of a track. We've got one, two, three analog inputs there, and the stick, an analog input there. That'll be a ground. That's a ground to LEDs. That switch is independent, that switch is independent. Yeah.
pretty nasty jobs, but there you go. One crude milling machine controller.